Numbers, numbers. Oh yeah, it says Laurel Bowie. It means it means Yanni, Yanni Bowie. Okay. <laughs> so, this is another treat box. It's called treats. And we're visiting Japan. <laughs> Tori Gate, Mijon Jima, Japan. <laughs> Japan seems to be a popular pick for okay. these kind of boxes. Let's hold it way. This month's treats come to you from Japan, an ancient and enigmatic country located in Asia. Japan's a country known for its innovation. Despite most of its land being unusable for industrial, industrial purposes, Japan has become one of the most technology, technologically advanced countries in the world. Mm -hmm. I stole it for you. So the first thing I see is they always have the fan, they always have funny cartoons on. Oh, is it kill the rabbit? <laughs> kill the rabbit. So it's a guy with an axe and it looks like some chocolate trees with caramel on them and a squirrel and a rabbit and a bear. Okay, let's see. Kikori no Kikarubu by Bourbon. Kikori no Kurikuri. Lumberjack stump in Japanese by bourbon are cookies shaped like a tree stump and which have a delicious delightfully crunchy wheat cookie wrapped in sweet Japanese chocolate Okay, here's something that looks cute every burger. Oh, yeah, we've had them different flavors. <laughs> He's got this funny little guy on it <laughs> Okay Every burger cookies by bourbon. Every burger cookies by bourbon are cheeseburger shaped cookies made from flaky bun biscuits with mini toasted sesame seeds as well as a chocolate patty filling. These treats are incredibly cute and delicious. You know what else is cute? That that pillow with the cheese balls. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should look for online and see if they uh, have a sheeny gummy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Looks like soda flavor. Hmm. Okay, so we've had these before. Fettuccine Gummy Cola by Bourbon. Fettuccine Gummy Cola by Bourbon are fun shaped gummy candies that looks like short fettuccine noodles. This cola flavored gummy candy is coated with bits of sugar and sour powder for a yummy crunchy in each for a, for a yummy crunch in each chewy bite. If you want to know what I was chewing on, watch our Universal Yums box one. Okay. I think I finally got the cheese off my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mine. <laughs> oh gosh, no. We'll do. Okay, let's see. So we got some. Looks like wafers with something in them. Bourbon. I guess something from Bourbon. Okay, and these are. And the pictures are small, plus some of the pictures don't match. Okay. Lumondo de Crepe Biscuits by Bourbon. Lumondo de Crepe Biscuits by Bourbon are crispy crepe biscuits covered in a thin layer of slightly sweetened chocolate frosting. The light frosting prevents the crumbly crepe biscuit from falling everywhere so you can enjoy without worrying about the mess. Anything exciting behind there? I'm just playing on the chairs. Okay, here's the Botan Rice Candy. Oh, yeah. These are ones where you can eat part of the wrapper. They're kind of weird. And it usually comes with a sticker. I got a weird one. It looks like some kind of Transformer thing. It's probably some kind of anime thing, though. <laughs> right. Oh, no! I don't like Transformers, mm. actually. Just That's what I thought it looked like. <laughs> Rice Candy by Bontan Nami. Bontan rice candy is a traditional Japanese candy. It is a soft, chewy, slightly lemon orange flavored candy with an hour layer of rice paper or oblot. A thin edible layer of starch useful for preserved gelatinous sweets by absorbing humidity. Nuki, you moved the camera. <laughs> Why does he do that? Like like father like son, I guess. Like to, both cats like to lay on the camera. Something, I've had something similar to this before except it had Stevie Dollar. Japanese rice cracker. Himi Maru. Himi Maru. Like a macaroon or something? Japanese crackers. Here we go. Not maggots. Grubs. You're right. They're grub shaped. Ew. Not maggots. 
Um. Next time, use berries, not insects. Hini Maru crackers by Amanoya. Hini Maru. Hime Marus are golden hued deep fried rice crackers in the shape of a shell. Crunchy with a light soy sauce flavor, this treat achieves the perfect balance between sweet and salty while retaining an incredibly crispy and fresh texture. Mm. It's too fresh. No. It's okay, so now the worms. Yeah. KK no tiny is rice crackers. So it's just rice crackers, but they just they're they're just like grubs. Grubs, yeah. yeah. Or some kind of teeth. Grubs. Okay, so these are little rice crackers. I'm sure they're good. Mm. Nope, that's not good. Okay, KK no tiny but yucky. Kiki no tines are crescent shaped soy flavored rice crackers with a crispy and crunchy texture. K no tine is um, ambiguous as a snack in Japan, and many people like to enjoy their Kiki no tans with a glass of beer. Okay. Blueberry. Lot blueberry something. Gum by lot. Gum by law are richly flavored fruit gum. In Japan, law has long been loved as gum maker with a history of releasing delightful, juicy flavors. This gum is rich in flavor and aroma. Also, it's due to the fact that they use shiso, a type of Japanese mint, to complement the juicy flavor. I thought gum wasn't really a thing in Japan. Like, maybe it's a different country. Mm -hmm. I, I did say they, it's not that popular, or when they do, it's kind of like a. They, it's not really gum, but it's, you chew it, it's like candy that chews like gum. There's some other country where they don't sell gum because I guess people spit it everywhere too yeah, much. Yeah, make a mess. How be shrimp chips baked? I've had these before. Wheat pop snacks original. Yeah, those have the real shrimp taste. These ones are only slightly shrimp flavored. I've had chips that were more yeah. shrimp flavored than this. Shrimp chips. Big shrimp chips by Calbee. Shrimp chips are big chips with a shrimp flavor. Virtually unheard of in America, it is one of the most iconic snacks in Asia. You might not be used to the taste at first, but try them. They can be addictive. Ooh. The last thing is one of these ice cream cone thingies. So it's like ice cream cone, but there's like a type of cake in there. It's, it's holy cake. I mean, you know, cake with lots of holes in it. So, what did you say? So, giant cookie goes the, the The cone is always broken when we open it, but I guess it's kind of hard to transit it. Giant Calipo by Gilco. The giant Calipo, Calipo looks like an ice cream cone, but instead of con continuing ice cream, the containing ice cream, the cone contains thick and fluffy layers of strawberry filling. This one's chocolate. <laughs> Feeling encompassing an inner layer of chocolate filled. Oh, wait, okay, so it's chocolate and strawberry. It's not ice cream, but it's just as awesome. Okay, should we try something? It's going very chipper. Bacon. We should try to eat the grubs. You want to try some of the grubs? Okay. okay. <laughs> oh, there's a little tab on the top of him. I see. And not and then I apple dipper. Unless you wanted to eat the stumpy stump stump that were in the grubs. Mm -hmm. Grubby grub grubs. Okay, I'm gonna take a couple. They just smell like soy sauce. They do look like they'll be good. It's just an interesting <laughs> yeah, shape. And color. <laughs> yeah. I think they got a nice mm -hmm. shine to them. Oh yeah, that's good. Oh, there's a little bit of spice at the end. Good, do you not taste it? It was good until I got the spice. Okay. It wasn't too much, but oh. I wasn't expecting that. So, I hope you must have got the big taste at the same time. Red pepper. Oh, no I wonder. Didn't know that. I thought oh. they were just going to be good crackers. Pepper so, if you liked our video, give us a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of these unboxing snacks, please subscribe to our channel. Bye. Bye.